Like, that is a head of hair you could write home about. Because you're worth it, Wara. <laughs> at the ADC here. I mean, we know Revolta is the most handsome man on the Rift, but Wara is uh, making a pretty good. Uh, yeah, I, I was, I was ready himself. to, I was ready to say it and be very confident in yeah. it, but at the moment, and Wara I just walked on him. It's like, ah, actually, Honestly, I'm not sure. So we got to try and focus in on the League of Legends that they're going to be playing. That is the most difficult. Important Atlas, part difficult. Here. It most certainly is, especially when we've got a close up of Revolta's face right now. That's just being cruel and mean. It's slightly unusual, but. Either way, yeah, uh, Wara. Let's get back, let's get back to it. I'm, I just I lost my mind just for a moment there. Yeah, boss. me too. I was just staring into yeah, staring into lost. his eyes. But Wara, uh, very impressive from what we saw yesterday. Uh, I was expecting him to be one of the aces of this team coming yep. into this. So I actually thought he was maybe going to be playing earlier to try and net them some points. Uh, but he is playing now, so he might be able to redeem them and stop them getting clean sweeped. Uh, on the opposite side, Revolta. He didn't have faith in himself. I had more faith in him than he did. So I want to see him just pick something like Lee Sin. It's not necessarily the best in one v ones anymore, but he has the mechanics on that champion. And Team Fire has already won! So you can just have have some fun, Revolta! YOLO! Doesn't even matter, we are! Get in the there! fans are already there! We've got Caitlyn Varys Misfortune taken away by Revolta. Nasus, Urgot, and Nunu are going to be the options removed by Wara. And he's spelled Nu. Nu. Which sounds no, like the voices of Team Ice all crying out in terror. Suddenly silenced. That last 1v1 ended making Team Fire victorious. victorious, unfortunately. But look at Revolta, he's hovering the Lee Sin. I very much hope that he does it. Oh, don't do it to us. That's why I'm locking the Lee Sin, so I look like a good analyst, um, <laughs> to be honest. But Wara locking in the, the Jin. Uh, I think it's pretty decent in the 1v1s. Miffy thinks it's trash, we'll see. Uh, Cassiopeia locked in for Revolta, okay. Yeah, that's odd. Wasn't expecting it. I was hoping that he'd have some fun. He did hover the Pantheon, which we've seen in and out of the bands, but not necessarily picked yet, I don't think, this 1v1 section of the tournament. Uh, what, Cassiopeia? No, 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 no. Uh, Pantheon. Uh, Pantheon? Pantheon? No, no, no. Has not. Uh, Jin neither. I not know. Picked, yeah. Well, we'll see whether Warangulus can actually make something happen on this Jin. I personally don't like it. I just don't like Jin. it. I, I don't yeah. know why. I just don't feel like it'd be good in a 1v1. I feel like he's just a little bit flimsy, maybe. Mm. Not necessarily the champion that you would want as far as trying to get a 1v1 victory. Yeah. However, Cassiopeia, very good in that department. We saw that happen earlier on. And uh, look, it's all up to fate now. And honestly, it doesn't really matter. I'm just excited to see what Revolta can do on a champion that he probably has never played as a jungler. Me too. It's interesting he went for Cassiopeia. It's just like, I'm a low mechanics player. Like, the highest mechanics I have at least in, very difficult champion. But yeah. let me go for the other high school cap champion of Cassiopeia in the mid lane and try and make that work. We'll see. Uh, it should theoretically be a good match of him into the Jin because just of how, in terms of ranges, she should be able to get yeah. on top of him, slow him down, just force him back and pick up the kill. Uh, Jin, on the other hand, just because of the disparity in it's an ADC playing an ADC versus a jungler playing Cassiopeia. Uh, he might be able to get in range and just land a couple cheeky auto attacks, land some spells, follow up with the ultimate and net a kill. Um, that is what Wara is looking for. Oh. Oh, oh, like ships in the night, they pass one another. Revolta taking so much damage. That last crit is going to do so much work, but fantastic timing on the exhaust. The ignite's ticking down. The barrier's there. Revolta so, so low, but can he get the last one? But not enough mana. There's the first blood as Team Ice gets one back. For Angelus, that hair obviously pulled him across the line. And these guys did not want to mess around. It's like minions haven't even spawned. Let's kill each other. Let's do it. Glorious. I mean, honestly, that was probably the best opportunity Revolta is going to get in that matchup in a prolonged trade and a prolonged 1v1.